<laughs> Throughout our relationship, Joy and I have learned a lot about each other and about each other's personalities. She has learned that one of my personality traits is imitation, or being a copycat, or a gaya in Tagalog. Um, sometimes I do tend to copy people, um, you know, people that I like, as imitation is the greatest form of flattery. Um, so if she'd say, Han, I love you, I'd say, Han, I love you. <laughs> and then she'd, she'd just roll her eyes and say, Gaya. <laughs> I always copy Joy for how she loves me, especially through words, letters, and deeds. On this special occasion, I'd like to quote Joy on a couple of her many letters to me. Most notably from our 33rd month anniversary and the letter she gave me on my last birthday. So here it goes. Lord God, as we endeavor our new path together, I pray that you bless us with overflowing love for each other. I pray, pray, pray that when all my hair turns white, my skin all wrinkled, when I start wearing dentures, that you'll be next to me when I wake up and I will be the person who I would watch when the sun sets. Lord God, I pray for all that Ryan is praying for. Please always keep us close to each other and closest to you. Have I found you? And then the right time came and God led Joy to meet this guy in New Zealand. First date, the first date was followed by calls, movies, dinner dates, and DVD marathons. Until one day, Joy decided to open her heart and take a journey of love with Ryan. And this love is the reason why we're all here. Now I'm a fat house cat Nurse and my soul <laughs> Hope today is a good day for you and that tomorrow is even better. Now I know why God made me travel the road I traveled. It's because He was leading me to you. Joy, did you come here of your own free will to bind yourself forever in the love and service of your husband? Say it clearly now. Yes, Father. Ah, good, good. Yeah, we must be. We must be. beloved wife. I pledge to you my unconditional love, respect and commitment all the days of my life. From this day forward, for better or worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, I will love you and honor you all the days of my life. So in, in response to your letter, babe, when we get older, I'll still love your hair. I'll still love your skin. I'll still love your teeth. <laughs> I'll cut up your meat and corn off the cob, and I'll be your walking stick when it gets hard to walk. I'll be next to you tonight when you wake up tomorrow and from each day following. And I'll be next to you 
watching all the sunsets as well as all the sunrises that come the next day. Thanks for saying yes, and I do. Thanks for the blessings you have shared with me, and I know our blessings will be multiplied along with our families and friends. I love you.